Yes, you can get fined if you cut an oak tree down, just like this. Welcome to episode one of the City Spotlight. My name is Calvin. I'm a realtor serving the greater Los Angeles area. And this series will help you choose the best city when moving to San Gabriel, California. Today we have... Monrovia! We are now in the heart of Monrovia, known as Old Town Monrovia. This is where everything and anything happens. Old Town Monrovia is center focused on small businesses and mom and pop shops. So if you're really trying to shop and get that family a feel, get close with the restaurant owners and the boutique shops, now this is the place to be. Really, it's wholesome, it's well kept, very clean. And if you're bored even on a Friday night, heck, we have the, fam we have the farmer's market and you can even ride a horse-drawn carriage here. Isn't that crazy? And I really emphasize family effect. Let's take a look, let's take a look around and you'll see what I mean. Especially if you're walking near the heart of Monrovia, Old Town Monrovia, just in the outskirts, what you tend to see are townhomes and condos. But there's one other thing that's the pride and joy of Monrovia. 1920s and 1930s craftsman homes, just like this one. In regards to the real estate here in Monrovia, you'll find that a lot of the townhomes and condos are centered around Old Town Monrovia. This street here of Myrtle. As you can see, everything, everything's happening here. Um, and for average prices of condos, if you're looking for a two bed condo around Old Town Monrovia, you're looking at an average price of 535,000. A three bed being around 670. For single family properties, you'll find that the most affordable properties are south of the 210. And as you go up more north towards the transition zone, you can find those multi-million dollar properties. But a two bed single family will run you just about 745,000. And a three bed, just under 900,000. As we walk just south of Old Town Monrovia, you can see the sign we're just leaving south. We can really see the 25 year plan of Monrovia. One of the plans is to aim to increase our housing supply by 15%. They're building this, if you can see in the distance, um, pretty close to the gold line that just opened up in 2016. That connects Los Angeles to Azusa. that big townhome and condo complex that we saw a little bit earlier. They even built another one right next to the station. Check this out. We're here now at the northern end of Old Town Monrovia. I'm here with my buddy Mark Twain. You've probably heard of him. Um, read one of his books in grade school. But and we have the Monrovia Public Library behind us. This is a historic building. It was originally built in 1908 and it got renovated recently in 2009. It now has its own room called the Heritage Room that allows Monrovians for years to come to learn about our history and our rich history. We're now in Northern Monrovia, a little bit closer to the mountains. Um, this area of Monrovia has actually made the headlines on the news a couple times because bears tend to come down. You know, if they get lost, Sometimes they wander the street. Um, I've had one encounter myself actually going up to Monrovia Canyon Park, encountering some bears. But uh, yeah, it's pretty crazy. 
<laughs> the Monrovia actually headquarters a lot of big businesses that we know, um, such as Trader Joe's and Naked Juice. And one familiar house you'll know here is this one, the Bird Box House. You probably recognize this. We're here at the entrance of Monrovia Canyon Park. Monrovia is a foothill city, so we sit right at the basin of the San Gabriel Mountains. Right now, the park's closed because we recently had a really big fire, but Monrovia has, like a lot of San Gabriel Valley cities, what I like to call the big three. If you're looking for the beach, we have a beach 40 minutes just west. If you're looking for a hike, heck, it's literally our backyard. Like this is a hiking trail. And if you're looking for some snow in the winter seasons, we have Big Bear Northeast, just about 45 minutes to an hour. Well, I hope this video has helped you get a sense of what Monrovia has to offer. If you ever need help with real estate in the greater Los Angeles area, feel free to send me a text, DM, or even give me a call. I'd love to help. I will see you on the next one.